pre-holiday kind of mini collective haul to share with you guys I've got um, a few goodies before I go away but not a lot because I'm trying to kind of um, go with less and come back with more <laughs> um, if that makes sense I've kind of had a bit of a clear out and um, yeah I'd like to do a little bit of shopping on holiday because I'm getting a bit sick of the shops here in London I'm not gonna lie uh, but anyway so I have purchased um, a few things that I want to share with you and I've also been sent a few things so I'll get to that in a minute too so first I'll start with um, an American apparel purchase I made that you guys um, are aware of if you watch my shorts lookbook because I featured it uh, in those uh, in that and it's these sunflower shorts that I am absolutely obsessed with I saw them um, on the American Apparel Instagram ages ago but I didn't realise it was the American one so I've been looking for them for so long and they only recently came out here in the UK and I nabbed them here they are so I'm taking these on holiday with me for sure but I absolutely adore those and um, I'm, I'll put the price in like a pop up because I don't remember how much they were uh, I, I also popped into Monkey recently and I um, saw this ages ago and I didn't buy it because it was one of those things that I kind of had to go home and kind of let the idea linger in my mind for a little bit and then I went back in there and decided to buy it. It's this hoodie dress contraption. I got it in an extra small. It was £30 and it's like a light grey and it's like an oversized hoodie dress with these kind of big sleeves. I think it's perfect for travelling. Um, I pair it with some comfy socks, maybe some comfy heels, and um, it's what I'm going to wear to travel to the States, so uh, I just really like that, and I'm very happy with that purchase that I finally went back and bought it. What else do I have for you lovely people? I popped into And Other Stories not too long ago, and I um, got this leather t-shirt. It was quite pricey but payday had just arrived so I wanted to treat myself it was £140 um, it is real leather I just really like how it's got this weird detailing on the front um, although this is actually like so it looks like you're wearing a leather top almost if that makes sense and then the back has got this like little bar I just really like it and I thought it was really nice I don't own any leather tops so I got that also from Anne Other Stories, I got this little fella, it's a ring, and it's like a little lion, well it, it is a little lion, and you would wear it on your finger, like this, and it kind of looks like he's holding on for dear life, I just love this, and I thought it was so cool when I saw it, it was £25, which again is a lot, but it's really good quality, and it doesn't make my finger go green, so I'd rather pay a little bit more, and know that I'm getting that then just buy cheap jewellery and eventually not wear it anymore because it's gone all funny coloured and my fingers have gone all green so I don't know. So in TK Maxx a couple weeks ago and like I said payday had just come around the corner and I like to go to places like TK Maxx um, when I've been paid because they have this thing, this section called Gold Label which I've spoken about before which is basically designer items for way cheaper because they're like old season and whatever which doesn't really make any difference to me. I was in there and I saw this Missoni, actual Missoni, um, kind of checkered bomber jacket. I mean, I don't really know how you would describe it, but I fell in love. I'm really into kind of neutral tones like black, grey, sorry, that's not really neutral, is it? I'm kind of into like those kind of tones, so like blacks and greys, and this is the kind of thing that you could throw over everything, and I'm going to take it to Miami as one of my like. Um, items to kind of throw on when it gets nippy because even when it gets nippy I mean like the air conditioning in certain places like when you go to the movies and stuff is freezing so um, or in restaurants so you might need um, I always actually end up buying one if I don't bring one so I thought I'd bring this one and also from TK Maxx I um, shared with you guys a Balmain, Pierre Balmain purchase that I got from there a while ago and I was in there again and I saw this jumpsuit and I'm a sucker for a jumpsuit but not all jumpsuits kind of work for me if that makes sense some of them are like really wedgy you some of them give you like this like saggy crotch and I saw this Pierre Balmain one and fell in love 
So it's got these like silver studs all along the collar and then it's got like this like biker jacket front and basically it's buttoned up here and it hangs down but it still covers your boobage so um, it's supposed to kind of hang down and show the studs, it's really cool. And then it goes into obviously a jumpsuit, it's um, got zips that are concealed on the ankles and it's also got zips on the bum. I am in love with this. This was £790 reduced to £199 and I think that was similar. So if you are in the Hammersmith area, definitely pop into the TK Maxx there because their gold label section is insane. They even have like Giuseppe Zanotti's and everything. Love it! I also found myself in Camden the other day with Luca because she wanted to go shopping. And so we did and I didn't intend on buying anything but we found this really cool shop um, when you go past Gilgamesh, there's kind of like these little shops under these like arches and they had this really fun menswear shop and they just did these really cool um, like faux leather tees and hoodies and stuff. I got Fabio a few and I saw these trackies and I just couldn't resist. I just think they're so nice. So they're a grey tracksuit but then they've got these like really cool detailing on like the knee and they are cropped which is great which means I can wear them with some high heels and I think they look really cool with like a t-shirt like this and I really like these yeah they're from a shop in Camden called um, Rabbit Hole so keep an eye out for it it's in like the market area um, so I'm gonna move on to some stuff that I was sent I was sent some goodies by um, Shop Wasteland, and um, I'm going to share with you what I was sent now. So, first of all, I want to say a big thank you, and I love all their stuff, and they have some amazing, amazing, amazing stuff. And check it out. So, I was sent this sweater, um, and it's like a loosely knit kind of crochet beige sweater, and um, it's got like a cutout back. I think this would look great with jeans and just like a really nice bra on holiday with some heels. It's by the brand Nameless and I got it in a size small that's available on their website I'll put the details down below. I also was sent this dress by Sunday's Lovin and it's this gorgeous floral floor length um, kind of maxi dress it's got these detailing around the side and it's got two slits down the front as you can kind of see such a beautiful dress and I'm so excited to wear that, taking those both on holiday with me. They also sent me um, this unif skirt which I adore, it's the same pattern um, to a unif dress that I have here. Um, but it's a skirt and it's got this zip and it's like really bodycon but then it's got this like fun length at the back, I absolutely adore it. My unif. I got this sweater, um, this is still all from Shop Wasteland, it's by 36.5, um, I wore this on um, an episode of Fash Tag, subscribe to Fash Tag by the way if you guys haven't, um, and it's just a really cute daisy sweater, it's really soft and nice, and last but not least um, is a pair of dungarees but it's a skirt edition so it's like a denim pair, and it's really fun and cute, it's like tight around the bum but um, like quite loose around the bust and I really like those too and those are by Cotton Candy in a small so definitely check them out thank you very much again for sending me all this amazing stuff so I'm now going to move on to some stuff that I got from Romwe and first of all I got this shirt um, it's in a small it's just a plain black and white striped shirt I thought it was a great piece to wear under um, a knit jumper because it's short sleeved so it won't be too hot like it would be if you were to wear a long sleeve shirt um it's just a really nice collar um, or it's a great crop piece to wear i like the fact that it doesn't have a tie waist for a change but i also got this really cute pastel top um it's like in a silky kind of material and it's like all these like yellow and uh kind of blue and pink tones just really nice loving that i got these two dresses that i absolutely adore and i'm going to take with me on holiday first is this like um is it a shift dress i don't know it's just a really nice cute dress and it's got this neon check pattern on it um and it's kind of like a 
textured silky material if that makes sense and then this is another silky material top it's kind of like a t-shirt dress i love it it's so bright and i'm taking this on holiday with me as well and uh, all of this is available from the romney Ro uh, romney <laughs> no the romney um oh wait one more item also from Runway, on the floor trying to escape. I got this amazingly soft t-shirt midi maxi, midi dress, um, slightly longer down by the ankles, but it's got this kind of like print on it. It's so soft and nice. Again, I'm gonna take that on holiday with me. So I'm trying to think, is that everything that I've bought recently? La -dee da -dee da I think it is guys, so um, my next video that I produce is probably going to be in uh, the United States of America. I'll be in Miami. If any of my subbies are in Miami, let me know down below. And I'll hopefully see you when I'm out there. Um, I hope you're all well. Um, and I will see you very, very soon. I love you all. Stay safe. Peace. Bye.